What's up guys and girls, it's EP with Styles of Life. Welcome to my new apartment. Let's go. So uh, I moved into Joji's old apartment. For those of you that don't know Joji, um, he's a, this famous R&B singer apparently. Um, I, I like his music. He's a He's featured and uh, collaborates a lot with uh, Rich Chiga, Rich Brian. Twelve in the morning, pop shells, pop a living name, baby, gon' smell blood trail every minute, bro. Some of you guys might know him. Yeah, it's cool that uh, I live in his old spot. How I found out, basically, I was going through the mailbox and there was like 500 mails, like letters and like packages in this little tiny mailbox because we live in this apartment building and there was all addressed to Joji and then the, 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 the receptionist was like, He's this cool dude, and I was like, yo, Joji, that sounds like the the, the singer. And he's like, dude, it is. I've been trying to collaborate with him, because like the front desk person, he sings a lot too, apparently. So like, yeah, um, the dude was never home. He was always on tour, and um, hence why there was so much letters for him and packages. Uh, so that's cool, fun fact, you know? I just moved into a new apartment, if you guys can't tell. Got a gorgeous view. I'm um, really happy about it, but before we get into anything, I want to talk about Jollygram real quick. It's the most advanced Instagram bot ever. There's a special going on right now. If you try the app out for free, you gain up to 500 real followers. Absolutely free, and then you got to begin automating your Instagram, and you know you don't have to be using it all the time, and you spend more time doing what you really want to do. For example, posting, like I always say, uh, stop scrolling and start posting. This is a great way to really get into doing that. I've been using it for the past two weeks now, gained about 400 solid followers that are like really active on my uh, Instagram account. Um, the way it works is basically you go on, you set up your account, you link your Instagram account to it, and you know, it auto follows, auto unfollows, auto likes, and has analytics where you can study and really focus on your growth for your profile. You can choose specific hashtags, locations that you want to auto like, like all the new posts that comes about. Um, it's a really neat tool. I really suggest you guys check it out. The link's gonna be right here. Um, click it, go to it, or you. I suggest doing it on the phone. Um, you know, shout out jollygram.co. Anyway, back to uh, the life update. Yeah, I moved into Joji's apartment. So he was the one living here, and he was literally living here and moved out a week before I moved in, uh, or like two weeks before I moved in. And you know, this apartment's amazing. I'm gonna do an apartment tour here uh, soon on the next video, so you guys gotta stay tuned for that. Uh, gotta clean up and furnish the apartment a little bit more. But I mean, we're pretty there, much there already. We got a lot of good, uh, stuff going on. We got like a gray theme going on. We got a balcony here. Um, yeah, there's a balcony. We're, like this is a balcony, and this is just a window. And yes, that is the Freedom Tower. That is downtown Manhattan, and that is the Brooklyn Bridge. If you guys can see it in the video. Um, yeah, what's really cool is um, I never thought I'd be here in such a short amount of time. I mean, I've only moved to New York what in the video. It was back in July, June. June 18th was my graduation. Uh, walking and then June June 19th was the day I stepped foot into New York June 19th and today is February 16th so damn near eight months not even eight months yet and I'm here guys and I feel great accomplishments I feel like there's no excuses no reasons to not go after what you want to go after there's really no other way to go about things other than to set goals, have an idea of what you want and how to manifest those goals and then attain those goals. Um, I mean, I'm nothing special guys. Like there really isn't anything to it other than to do it. <laughs> and that's cheesy as it may sound, but like, I'm really not that special guys and it's really about the energy you have and exert into the universe. I say this all the time. I mean, we all have our own struggles. We all have different struggles. One of the things I struggle most with nowadays is really managing my time, especially being in New York and really living a fast paced life and maintaining all these relationships and being at work all the time while doing work on the side, hence not posting as much videos as I'd like. But I mean, I 
reaching my goals that I've set for myself, you know, reaching the, the, the money mark, the money goals, the knowledge goals, um, just really allocating my time. It's one of the things I struggle most with. It's one of the things I'm mastering at the same time because I'm focused on it so much. And there's a lot of things I've been wanting to do and I've been doing, and there's a lot of things I'm still going to do. Um, so I, I just love that, you know, there's always time for me um, to really do what I want to do, like make these videos and share with the world, the internet, you guys. I'm not doing it for the views, right? I'm here to do it to document myself for whoever's following and also for myself. Like I said, it's, it's really to remember where I was and where I am and where I want to be. Um, because time moves just in one speed, right? I've said this before in a video, I'm not sure which video, but uh, I say this a lot, is time is the most valuable thing to me. Yeah, money's cool, um, happiness is awesome, all the pleasures in life is amazing, but when it comes to time, in my opinion, that's the most valuable thing, especially when you know I lost my grandfather a couple years ago. It's really about managing time and having time. And I, I value time so much that it's the most important currency to me. Uh, Cause you can't be wasting time. You can't be like saving time. Like it doesn't work like that. You can't put time in a piggy bank. You know, you you spend time every single day, every single second, every single moment, and that's like the most important thing to me right now. And that's really where I'm I'm at right now in life. I mean, the time I have here, it's like beautiful. Like every single day, I wake up and I see this like from my bed, and it's. It's an unbelievable feeling. I, I thought this wouldn't, I wouldn't be at this point in life for another couple of years. But then again, it goes back to time and how you really focus your time on things that make you grow as a person. The quote I sent out to our group where we share a lot of quotes every day, and I suggest everyone out there, you know, that's motivated to become better every single day, just like I am, better than yesterday is the, is the, is the motto, right? I suggest making a group chat of your, of your closest friends or people that are trying to become better every day that you know, and um, really be consistent with it just to remind each other what it is you do every day and why you do it, right? And today's quote that I put in there is from John Elway, right? It's, uh, I became great by becoming good over a long period of time. And that's so much facts. It goes back to celebrating the small wins. I was listening to Eric Thomas say this, celebrating the small wins and having big dreams because without the small wins, you can't get those big wins. If you're so focused on the big wins only and not the small wins, you might never even get a big win because at the end of the day, those small wins add up to big wins. And that's why I made these videos, going back to it. It's like, yeah, six months, eight months ago when I was making that video movie in New York, that was huge, right? But I didn't know how big, I didn't know, like you go watch that video, I'm gonna put it right here, in the balloon, over here, what, here or whatever, but you see that like, I don't know what's gonna happen. I don't know where I was gonna be. I didn't know what I was gonna do. Now I'm making this video, I know exactly where I'm at. And I have such a clear mind now of what I need to do to build more value and scale the value so that I can present it and share it with the world. It really is what it comes down to. And I want all you guys to, uh, you know, really become better every single day. That's really what this whole YouTube channel was really about at the beginning. I just got in front of a camera and started talking. I try to be as positive as I can every single day. I try to be as much, portray as much energy as I can because I can only depend on myself when it comes to 100% energy because I can, of course, you know, take in other people's energy, but I know for a fact that I can control my own energy because I'm the only one that's in my body. So then that's why I get up every single day. If you guys haven't followed my Snapchat or my Instagram account, the links are down below in the description. Um, follow that and I highly suggest it because every single day I'm posting in the mornings. Every single day in the morning, right when I wake up. I got an alarm every single day at 3.36 a.m. No matter what, even on the weekends, I'm gonna, I'm gonna stay out. I wake up every day and I make this video and I send my energy out to everyone. The, the real reason why I do that is because every day I get messages and get reached out to and say, hey, I really felt that energy. Hey, like, thank you for that. It's become a thing where I've been doing it every day for a couple years now, and the consistency is important. And, you know, my best friend, Jeff, you guys might know him, you guys might not, you guys wanna see videos, you know, 
Uh, he's in a couple of my videos and he said, when we go old, we look back, like, wouldn't it be awesome to say like, hey, you did that like every day, for, like 10 years, 20 years. Like that's something you did every day, like that was you. And it's awesome for me too, because when I do it, I, I gather energy for myself for the day to conquer the day. It goes back to the time value. When I value my time so much, I need to have that energy to really perform excellently, excellently, <laughs> to really perform well at, at whatever task I'm doing, whatever task I hand. I know it's been a while, but you know, the whole point of this video is really share with you guys jollygram.co. It's one of a, a friend of mine, he built this uh, app that really helps with automating Instagram. Um, you know, it's really great. I've been using it. I'm about to use it for uh, one of my business accounts. Um, stay tuned for that and we'll see how that goes. And you know, if you guys have any uh, comments or anything, questions, remember to comment down below. I'm always answering. I'm always trying to stay active with you guys. Stay tuned for the next video. I'm gonna show you guys the apartment. You know, I can't give you guys everything. I can't just show all my cards uh, right away. You know, like this view is pretty, uh, pretty, it's pretty, Come on guys, like I'm sitting here, I'll be working, I'll be editing my video. And I just look to my right, it's Freedom Tower. I look to my left, it's Brooklyn. I look to my front, it's Brooklyn. Like, I'm in Brooklyn right now, guys. Stay tuned, like I said. Next video is coming up soon. Um, I'm excited. Uh, every single day I get this view and I just get excited to make videos for you guys. I don't know, one day I can make a video on the balcony, I can sit on my desk, I can sit on my couch, I can sit on the roof. Oh, you guys aren't even ready for the roof. If you like my video, please click like, click subscribe, comment down below. Until next time, 